As the universe continues to reveal its secrets to us, astronomers and space enthusiasts alike are thrilled at the latest discovery made by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST. NASA's Infrared Observatory captured images of a well-known early galaxy, SPT 0418 and 47, which has been previously studied for its bright, dusty, star-forming characteristics. However, in a recent analysis of the early JWST data, Cornell astronomers made a serendipitous discovery, a companion galaxy previously hidden behind the light of the foreground galaxy. In this video, I will explore the findings of this groundbreaking discovery and what it means for our understanding of early galaxy formation. But before we continue, I would like to take a moment to express my gratitude towards our channel's supporters. Your generous support allows us to continue bringing you informative and quality content. We truly appreciate your contribution. Thank you so much for being a part of our community and for supporting our work. In the early universe, there was a galaxy named SPT 041847, one of the brightest and dustiest star forming galaxies. Its light was bent and magnified by the gravity of a foreground galaxy into a circle known as an Einstein ring. NASA's James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, was observing this galaxy when astronomers discovered a surprise companion galaxy hidden behind the light of the foreground galaxy. Despite being only 1.4 billion years old, the companion galaxy appeared to have already hosted multiple generations of stars, something none of researchers has expected. Moreover, the galaxy was super chemically abundant, which opens up new avenues for studying how stars and galaxies formed in the early universe. Further analysis of the data confirmed that the two galaxies were the same distance from Earth, calculated as a redshift of about 4.2, and were located within 5 kiloparsecs of each other. This proximity suggests that they are bound to interact with each other, potentially merging, providing insight into how early galaxies evolved into larger ones. What made the companion galaxy particularly surprising was its mature metallicity, similar to that of our Sun, which is over 4 billion years old. This indicates that at least a couple of generations of stars had already lived and died within the first billion years of the universe's existence. The discovery was made possible by JWST's infrared vision, which is much more powerful than previous telescopes like the Atacama Large Millimeter Submillimeter Array, ALMA, in Chile. The findings have led the researchers to submit a proposal for further James Webb observation time to study the ring and its companions and reconcile any potential differences observed between the optical and far infrared spectrums. And now, it's time to answer one of your questions. This comment comes from Leo, who brings up a controversial point about black holes. Leo says, Is there a black hole in our Milky Way galaxy other than Sagittarius A? And is it possible for a black hole to come to our solar system? Thank you for bringing up this question, Leo. The answer is yes. There are other black holes in our galaxy besides Sagittarius A. In fact, there could be as many as 100 million black holes in the Milky Way alone. However, most of these black holes are not visible because they do not emit any light. Instead, astronomers can detect their presence through their gravitational effects on nearby stars and gas. As for the second part of your question, it's highly unlikely that a black hole will come to our solar system. Even if a black hole were to pass close to our solar system, the gravitational effects on the planets would be minimal. However, a close encounter with a black hole could have catastrophic effects on the Oort cloud, a region of icy objects that surrounds our solar system. So there you have it, Leo. Thank you for your question, and keep watching for more exciting space news and discoveries. And that wraps up today's video. If you have any questions or thoughts you'd like to share, please don't hesitate to leave a comment below. And if you enjoyed this video, please feel free to share it with family and friends who might be interested. Thank you for watching.